Alert Weather with meteorologist Ted Schmidt. Big dose of snow yesterday across the area. Rochester, uh, a light amount of accumulation, but enough to make for a nasty start to the day. Today, nothing like that to worry about. We had 2.2 inches of snow officially in Rochester. Uh, and from that snow event, some areas of the southeast actually had heavy snow up to six is six and a half inches in the far northeast Iowa from that storm system. Today it's clouds and a quiet morning commute as you see traffic moving along nicely on Highway 52 and in, on Broadway in downtown Rochester. That's our Lewis Auto camera. Temperatures right now close to 20. In fact, in the Med City Airport, it's 20 right now. It's 18 in Dodge Center, Mesa City 17 and 23 in Zambroda. Gray skies right now, a fairly tame westerly breeze. It'll be light throughout the day and so we don't have to worry about a lot of rough winds to deal with. The temperatures Actually, not bad for this time of the morning for January standards. Typically, we'd be grateful to be above zero, but 20 right now. That's not bad. The wind chill index right now, nine gray skies. We see some very sparse activity showing up on radar. Really nothing impacting us so far. We may see a few flurries at first from this, but later in the day, more snow will come in from the west. That happens during the evening commute. That's when things get a little slick again. So look for um, a minor coating of snow, but enough to maybe slow the evening commute a bit uh, in several hours. But right now, a quiet morning commute. Gray skies, 22, a light west and northwest breeze, cloudy and seasonably cold. Chance of snow late afternoon and evening. Another round of snow is possible mostly on Friday. It may start as early as Friday or Thursday night and lasting through Friday. Some accumulation possible in that time frame. And then the weekend, a little quieter, but downright cold. We have sub-zero temperatures and brutal wind chill values in our future, uh, especially by the time we get to Sunday. But right now, future track, a great picture this morning. Very quiet morning commute. Going into the afternoon, we begin to see a few flurries. Then after about 5 o'clock, we start seeing some snow uh, and some minor accumulation developing across the map. That lasts until about midnight, with that wave of low pressure. Later tonight, gray skies hold on. Temperatures in the teens. Tomorrow's some peaks of sunshine, but cold air coming in. Temperatures tomorrow barely getting above 20. And then heading into tomorrow night, extra clouds. We see some snow building northward. Some of that may impact the area by the morning commute on Friday. And most of the day will be in and out of the, of the rounds of snow with maybe some accumulation across the map. Now, today's accumulation, late afternoon, evening, less than an inch in Rochester. Most of the area on the minor side of things, less than an inch. But we may see as much as an inch and a half of snowfall in just a few pockets of the southeast part of the area during the evening time frame. And the best chance of that happening between 6 and 9, tapering off just before midnight tonight. And the next round of snow tomorrow night and Friday, three or more inches of snow will be possible in the area. Right now we're going to track that and pin that down, but the possibility of uh, several inches of snowfall in a few spots in that Friday storm system. So that's something that we're going to be watching closely uh, Friday and wrapping up Friday night. Beyond that, Arctic air comes in. Look at these numbers. Sub-zero high temperatures Sunday and Monday. And because of that, those are going to be some first alert weather days because of brutally cold wind chill values uh, for the early part of next week. Today, 27, a light breeze. Periods of snow late in the afternoon after 4 or 5 o'clock and during the evening time frame, but certainly impacting the evening commute. Up to an inch, maybe an inch and a half of snow this evening. 17 overnight. 7-day forecast tomorrow. Snow in the overnight hours. Tomorrow during the day, a quiet day, and then snow on Friday. Possibility of snow early Saturday. Then the Arctic air comes in first alert days Sunday through Tuesday. Oh, wow. So a lot of things happening, a lot of wintry elements there to talk about. Uh, in contrast to what was a strange December mm -hmm. and featured more rain, uh, days of rain and yeah. then snow. And yeah. now it's definitely winter now. Definitely a busy week. Yeah, mm -hmm. you could say for this uh, week in January. And